Uh, first thing I did is uh, put the back end all the way down. I got that bar where it just come over the top of this and stuck out. And I tack welded it on both sides. Uh, I left the other one being able to move. I actually relocated them back to the cell. They were bolted down there. This makes the table even and uh, helps it rise up better. I used a uh, side of a frame, shelving frame, for my platform. I actually don't have it bolted down yet. That's what it looks like. It's about 18 inches wide. I just went and got some plywood. Uh, this thing is on wheels, too, so if you're working on your project, you can actually scoot it around. I've got a rail there, so if you're raising it up or letting it down, it can actually slip, so I'm going to go back and do something so that bolt won't slide back and forth it makes the table jiggle. Uh, as you can see it moving there. It's not too safe when you got 100 pounds. I'm just going to use this for little motorcycles and stuff. But, uh, that's where we have the problem. As you can see, the lift's about the same size as a regular table. I guess that's about three foot, so that'll put the motor up a little bit higher. This is my demo model. I don't work on these. But anyway, I'll show you it working. Front is lowering. And of course, when you got your bike attached to something, that movement ain't going to happen. And that's it.